very Christmassy this morning. I know. And that is for a very good reason. This is vlog 504. And we are driving the brand new 2017 Nissan 370Z. So we decided to drive it somewhere unique. Where we're going? Nissan's Village. We are going. That's why I'm dressed Christmassy. Right. You're not. Uh, I have Christmas underwear on. You said you were going to wear your Santa hat. I'm going to get one while I'm there. <laughs> For those of you that don't know what Santa's Village is, uh, it is a, a place that both Kathy and I went to as kids. So it's a really old place. I mean, like, way old. And then it shut down for a number of years and was completely derelict until recently, the past maybe couple of years, it was bought out and rebuilt. It's all brand new. They just had their launch and we are going to drive up there in this new Nissan and go check it out and take you guys along with us. It's a gorgeous morning. Welcome to Fireball Malibu Vlog. This is how we roll. We are at Sky Park Sam's Village. Kathy's in the restroom. They have done a phenomenal job at redoing this place. It's funny how it brings me back where it started. This is an outdoor fireplace, but all this wood is made out of steel. what you call these things but we're gonna ride these things I don't know what they are but uh, are they pedal cars yeah, yeah. oh okay. they're pedal and electric power pedal and electric okay all right then you know it's Christmas when the snow starts to fall then you know it's Christmas for the children above all. Then you know it's Christmas. This is absolutely awesome. Oh, I think I need to break. Pedal hard, pedal hard. I just back up. It's Christmas Day. The joyful times we witness. Forever stays with us. That was awesome, man. That was totally cool. That was better than the drive up. Fierce his whistle and gathers all his friends. When Santa and his missus wraps the final gift, 
You know it's time for Christmas For each and every one This is Santa's Village Mining Company. This is a, a bag full of good stuff. We don't know. We're gonna go mine it and see if anything good comes out of it. And then you know it's Christmas. <laughs> this is the coolest place. This is really amazing. I think it's kind of like the happiest place. Yeah, there There's the original bees. Those used to hang from there. And they would go right across here around the whole park. I bet you they're gonna come back though. Kathy's going for it. <laughs> it's going to be a lot easier than the rocks you normally no, climb. I, I would agree to this, I'm sure. Go to the next one with your right hand. Grip with your left. <laughs> you almost got it. Do it again. You can do it. Do the same one. Jump! <laughs> Good job. Okay. And enough? Yeah. That was ridiculous fun. I know. A great respect for rock climbers. <laughs> oh my God. If there's any rock climbers watching right now, I don't know how you guys do it, but. weekend was completely sold out. Kids are still in school, so it's pretty quiet, but this is a spectacular park. They have done a phenomenal job with all these buildings. If you want something to do with your with your kids for Christmas, this there nothing beats coming up here. There's real snow on the ground. The food is fantastic. The trains moving. It's really awesome. I, uh, well, today I'm a town crier, which means that I announce events and uh, also in the meantime, you know, there's not events all the time, so in the meantime I juggle for people and I, you know, I'm a general information guy. People can come over and ask me, like, you know, what is there to do? When is this happening? Everybody seems so happy here. It's pretty I, great. Yeah, yeah everyone's really got smiles on their faces. I really enjoy it, yeah. Yeah, yeah all of my coworkers, I, I don't think there's a single unhappy one because we're just, you know, it's the most fun job in the oh, world. Oh, yeah, yeah. And it's, yeah, and it's bringing so much to our mountain community. I, you're going like, to give Disneyland a run for its money as far as being the happiest place on Earth. <laughs> this I is sure pretty so. cool. Yeah. Uh, what, is there any message you want to give to kids this year? We want you to be good, do everything the grown-ups tell you to do, 
and I want to tell you, Rudolph and I are looking forward to coming to your homes again this year. Christmas spirit is not just for Christmas time. We want you to keep that Christmas spirit all year long. Ho, 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 ho. You see this? Right here, this is an, an exit of a tunnel and these old classic cars used to come around back in 1970. This is where the track was and that's the cars. My very first car that I drove was a Model T out of that tunnel. Pretty awesome. These are the original cars. They have been restored. There's only two left. All right, so these are the original cars. There's only two left. So they got auctioned off originally, and then these guys managed to buy two of them back, and they're on display here. This is kind of a private thing. They don't let people climb on them because they don't want them to get ruined. But I get a chance to climb in one. So they're so much smaller from what I remember. Yeah, this brings back memories. And there was a horn on the side. Oh. And my brother was constantly squishing the horn, <laughs> drove me nuts. This is pretty amazing. This is pretty incredible. Uh, Bill is the owner and the, I don't know. General how, manager. The general manager of the park. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's phenomenal. Thanks. It's phenomenal. Uh, it must have been a lot of work. Uh, three years. Three years? Yeah, three years. It took him a year to build the park originally. Okay. Opened two months before Disneyland. And then, 1955? Uh, yeah, 1955. 1955. Yeah. They started construction in 1954. Wow. And it took us three years to <laughs> fix it. <laughs> it was a mess. It was a mess. It was a mess. Yes, but you've done a phenomenal yeah. job. What was yeah. the impetus? What was the inspiration for you wanting to do something like this? I started started out as being an absolute uh, different kind of theme park, to be an adventure park. Yeah. Like camp for a day. Yeah. That was the idea. I'd bring families up. They could mountain bike ride, fly fish, hike, uh, get out and see the, the forest and do an environmental science program. So you yeah. could come up and learn together with your family. Right. So that's how it started. Wow. And then as things developed and the demand from uh, the community, Southern California, California community came to be that they wanted Santa's village back. Oh yeah. We then designed in and really went full boat on Santa's village. Oh, it's phenomenal, including it. Arrow, which is Santa's dog right here. Yeah, he's he's great. <laughs> 
Well, yeah. thank you for, for doing this. Yeah. I can speak thank for you. Southern California. Thank yeah. you for doing it. Thank you. Awesome. Appreciate it. Right. Love it. There's a candy shop. We didn't go into the candy shop. We didn't? Uh, we need to do this first. to leave and then the train came by this you catch this little choo-choo and it goes all over the park so we're gonna take a quick tour uh, and then we'll go it went by so fast I barely did see Last. Big thanks to um, to Jennifer and the guys that invited us up. Really, really cool. Uh, what was your favorite part? You know what? My favorite part was meeting all the people. Yeah. I mean, we literally know everybody here at this point. We even <laughs> got to meet the owner. Yeah. Who you will get to see also. You will. And uh, he's the one walking around with Arrow the dog. Yeah. Uh, you got to come up. It's really awesome. <laughs> is empty. Actually, uh, we bought quite a bit of candy. It's it's in my stash. Sky Park Santa's Village. What an amazing place. Wow. Extraordinary place. Uh, we were back in an hour and 39 minutes, so uh, not too bad. You know, traffic wasn't that bad. We just had so much fun that the, the place is themed so well. It's rebuilt so well. Uh, I'm sure it's going to be very successful. If you live in LA, you can go there for the day. I mean, we were there for about four hours. We did the majority of things that uh, that you can do, but there's so many other things coming. They're going to be open for the summer. They're going to have mountain bike trails. They're going to have fly fishing. They're going to have a uh, an RV park. There's all kinds of things that are coming. I, I think Bill mentioned this, that uh, they're only using about 15 acres and there's about 200 acres available to them. So they bought a, a very large piece of land and a lot of that back stuff has already been done. Okay, the Wheels and Waves cards, collector cards have shown up right there. Wheels and Waves, our new show happening at the Malibu Country Mart, January 15th. Gonna be epic. There's so many people that are gonna be there. So many cool cars. It's gonna be happening, like I said, at the Malibu Country Mart. Look how beautiful that is. Isn't that awesome? All right, that's it for today's vlog. Thanks for hanging out with us. Uh, had a really good time, uh, a lot of fun stuff, but uh, tomorrow we have some interesting things that are going on. I'm also gonna be taking you guys to a, an exclusive premiere of the movie Passengers tomorrow evening. You, you don't really get a chance to watch the movie. I'm gonna watch the movie. I'm gonna let you know what I think. I think it's gonna be really cool. That's on tomorrow's vlog. We'll see you then.